Tonight, we're looking into posts being spread on social media. They claim the James Webb Space Telescope spotted a large object about 10 light years away. Stargazers and astronomers alike have been captivated by the massive red supergiant star known as Betelgeuse for a very long time. Betelgeuse is located in the constellation Orion. The cosmic giant in question has been the focus of intense scrutiny in recent years particularly in the wake of an unprecedented dimming event that occurred in the latter half of 2019 and the early part of 2020. However, in a shocking turn of events, the James Webb Space Telescope, also known as JWST, has recently detected an extraordinary 1,000% increase in the brightness of Betelgeuse. This has caused waves of excitement and intrigue to spread throughout the scientific community. Before we start, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more updates. This sudden increase in brightness has left astronomers perplexed, and they are eager to gain a better understanding of the factors that are responsible for it. Due to the fact that it is getting close to the end of its life cycle, Betelgeuse, which is one of the largest stars that can be seen with the naked eye, is prone to experiencing significant shifts in both its brightness and its behavior. The unexpected brightening is one of the most significant and unusual phenomena that has been observed in the star's recent history. It represents a challenge to the models and theories that have been in place for a long time and have governed our understanding of the evolution of stars. Due to its size and proximity to Earth, Betelgeuse is one of the stars in the night sky that receives the most attention from researchers. It is a class of star known as a red supergiant, which is a type of star that is significantly older and significantly more massive than our Sun. Betelgeuse is getting close to the end of its life and when it finally runs out of fuel, it is anticipated that it will result in a supernova explosion. The precise timing of this explosion is still unknown, despite the fact that it is a well-established outcome for a star of its kind to eventually explode. The recent increase in brightness has only served to give rise to more speculation regarding the possible events that are taking place deep within the star. For a number of different reasons, the sudden brightening that was detected by the JWST is surprising. There have been fluctuations in the brightness of Betelgeuse in the past. However, these changes have been gradual and have followed predictable patterns that are linked to the pulsations of the star. It is well known that red supergiants like Betelgeuse go through cycles of expansion and contraction, which naturally cause their brightness to change over the course of time. Nevertheless, a brightness increase of 1,000% is significantly higher than the typical fluctuations that are anticipated from these pulsations. The magnitude of this event gives rise to the hypothesis that something significantly more significant is taking place either within the core of the star or in its outer layers. This event may have occurred because Betelgeuse is entering a new phase of its life that is more unstable, which is one of the possible explanations for this matter. The outer layers of stars of this size can become increasingly unstable as they age, which can result in sudden and massive outbursts of energy. The star releases significant portions of its outer material into space, which results in these outbursts, which are also sometimes referred to as shell ejections. It is possible that the dramatic increase in brightness that was observed by the JWST could be attributed to the fact that Betelgeuse has been subjected to a shell ejection equivalent to this magnitude. Alterations in the core of Betelgeuse could be another possible explanation for the sudden brightening that occurred. There is a shift occurring in the fusion processes that occur at the core of red supergiants as they get closer to the end of their lives. It is believed that Betelgeuse is undergoing the process of fusing heavier elements, such as oxygen and silicon in order to get ready for its eventual massive explosion. In the outer layers of the star, changes in these fusion processes have the potential to cause behavior that is both violent and unpredictable. One possible interpretation of the recent brightening is that it is an indication that Betelgeuse is entering the final stages of its life. Despite the fact that this does not necessarily indicate that a supernova is about to occur, it does indicate that significant changes are currently taking place. Betelgeuse's behavior has been mysterious in the past, which is something that should be taken into consideration despite the excitement that is surrounding this event. Following the well-known dimming event that occurred in 2019, there was widespread speculation that the star might be on the verge of exploding into a supernova. 
Subsequent observations, on the other hand, demonstrated that the dimming was brought about by a massive cloud of dust that was expelled by the star, which momentarily obscured its light from the perspective of Earth. It is possible that this recent brightening is also deceiving, and that it is caused by another dust-related phenomenon or some other external factor. With that being said, the sheer magnitude of the brightness increase that was detected by the JWST gives the impression that this is not merely a passing occurrence. In the event that Betelgeuse is, in fact, on the verge of undergoing a significant transformation, it may provide researchers with a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to investigate a red supergiant that is in the midst of its final stages. In spite of the fact that we have witnessed supernovae in galaxies that are very far away, the Betelgeuse galaxy is so close that any such event would be visible in extraordinary detail. As a result of this proximity, if Betelgeuse were to explode, we would be able to observe the process in real time, thereby capturing data that could significantly improve our understanding of the evolution of stars and the mechanics of supernovae. Beyond the star itself, the sudden brightening of Betelgeuse has implications that extend beyond the star itself. If our galaxy were to experience a supernova, it would have repercussions that would be felt throughout the surrounding region of space. It is fortunate that Betelgeuse is located at a distance of approximately 640 light years from Earth. This distance is sufficient to ensure that any potential supernova would not directly threaten our planet. The explosion, on the other hand, would still be a remarkable and potentially life-changing occurrence. It was possible that Betelgeuse would become visible in the daytime sky for weeks or even months, reaching a brightness that was comparable to that of the moon. A wealth of information regarding the aftermath of a supernova, including the formation of neutron stars or even black holes, would be made available to astronomers as a result of the event. Researchers in the field of astronomy are working feverishly to collect as much information as they can in the immediate aftermath of this brightness surge. There are observatories all over the world, both on the ground and in space, that are focusing their attention on Betelgeuse in the hopes of capturing every nuance of this unfolding drama. Due to its unparalleled capability to observe in infrared wavelengths, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is particularly well suited to investigate the outer layers of Betelgeuse, as well as the material that it may be ejecting into space. It is possible that the observations made by the telescope will enable one to determine whether this increase in brightness is the result of a significant change in the structure of the star, or whether it is the result of an external factor such as dust or gas clouds interacting with the light that Betelgeuse emits. This sudden brightness has also rekindled my interest in researching other red supergiants, which is a very exciting development. Betelgeuse is one of the closest and most prominent examples. However, there are a great number of other stars in the Milky Way that are in a stage of their life cycle that is comparable to the one that Betelgeuse is in. If the behavior of Betelgeuse is indicative of a phase of red supergiant evolution that has not been known about before, then this could lead to a more comprehensive re-evaluation of our understanding of how these stars behave as they get closer and closer to the end of their periods of existence. In turn, this could improve our ability to predict supernova events, which could potentially offer more precise timelines for when other nearby stars might undergo transformations that are comparable to those witnessed by the supernova. As a result of the increase in Betelgeuse's brightness, the importance of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, and other advanced observatories in the field of astronomy is particularly highlighted. Scientists are gaining new insights into phenomena that were previously difficult or impossible to study as a result of the ability of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, to observe the universe in unprecedented detail. In the case of Betelgeuse, the observations made by the telescope are providing individuals with a front row seat to one of the most dramatic events that can occur in the lifetime of a star. This process may take place over the course of years or even decades. These observations are not only enhancing our comprehension of Betelgeuse, but they are also providing us with new insights into the more general processes that govern the life and death of stars. A reminder of the dynamic and frequently unpredictable nature of the universe is provided by the mystery that surrounds the sudden increase in brightness of Betelgeuse. Despite the fact that scientists have made significant progress in comprehending the life cycles of stars, there is still a great deal that is unknown. 
These kinds of occurrences serve as a potent reminder that our models and theories, despite their level of sophistication, are still in the process of developing. The sudden brightening of Betelgeuse is a perfect example of how unexpected phenomena can challenge long-held assumptions. Each new observation offers the potential to revise or expand our understanding, and the sudden brightening of Betelgeuse could change our understanding. The investigation into the sudden and unprecedented increase in brightness of Betelgeuse by a thousand percent is currently underway, and scientists are currently exploring a variety of hypotheses in an effort to explain the anomaly. The erratic behavior of the red supergiants has reignited people's interest in stellar processes that continue to be shrouded in mystery, particularly in the later stages of the evolution of a star. Despite the fact that Betelgeuse is notorious for its unpredictable fluctuations in brightness as a result of its pulsating nature, this recent surge is significantly outside of the typical range of variation that is observed in the star's life cycle. Now that the James Webb Space Telescope, also known as JWSE, is delivering high-resolution data, the astronomy community is working feverishly to figure out what could possibly be the cause of such a catastrophic event in this aging behemoth of the universe. It would be impossible to overstate the importance of the JWST in this investigation. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is the most advanced space observatory that is currently in operation. It provides access to the outer layers of Betelgeuse that have never been seen before. This access can provide essential insights into the forces that are at work within the star. Infrared wavelengths are captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, which enables it to see through any dust clouds or atmospheric particles that may have obscured earlier observations. This provides astronomers with the ability to study the surface and atmosphere of the star with an unprecedented level of precision. This capability is essential to determining the cause of the current state of increased luminosity that Betelgeuse is experiencing, and each new data set provides fresh leads in the investigation that is currently being conducted. There is a possibility that the dramatic increase in brightness of Betelgeuse could be linked to an internal phenomenon that has, up until this point, eluded observation. This is one of the most exciting prospects that scientists are investigating. As they get closer to the end of their lives, red supergiants like Betelgeuse are known to fuse elements that are progressively heavier. They begin by fusing hydrogen, then move on to helium, and finally end up fusing elements such as oxygen, silicon, and iron. This fusion process causes extreme pressure fluctuations within the star, which can manifest as surface instability, violent mass ejections, or even catastrophic events like supernovae. These fluctuations can be caused by a number of different factors. It is possible that the sudden brightness spike that was detected by the JWST is an indication that Betelgeuse has entered a volatile phase of its evolution. This phase is characterized by the fact that the core dynamics of the star are causing changes that are unpredictable at the surface of the star. Because the red supergiant is getting closer and closer to the end of its stellar life, one of the most significant processes that is taking place inside of Betelgeuse is the fusion of elements that are getting heavier and heavier. It has been hypothesized by scientists for a long time that when a star of this size fuses elements such as oxygen and silicon, it creates a complex and delicate equilibrium between the gravitational forces that pull inward and the radiation pressure that pushes outward. Core collapse is a phenomenon that can occur when this equilibrium is disrupted. Core collapse is characterized by the sudden collapse of the star's core under its own weight, which is then followed by an enormous release of energy during this process. This is the event that will cause a supernova explosion to occur. The recent brightening of Betelgeuse raises the possibility that the star is undergoing intense internal changes that could culminate in a supernova at some point in the near future. Although there is no certainty that this signal indicates that a supernova is about to occur, it does raise the possibility that such an event is occurring. The surface of Betelgeuse is also a subject of active research, in addition to the core fusion processes that are being investigated. It is well known that red supergiants have surfaces that are highly dynamic and unstable. This is because the convection cells that dominate their outer layers are responsible for this. As heat is transferred from the core to the surface, these cells are enormous bubbles of plasma that rise and fall in an upward and downward direction. Because of the enormous size of Betelgeuse, 
which is estimated to have a radius that is approximately 700 times that of the Sun. The convection cells that are found in this star are significantly larger and more turbulent than those that are found in smaller stars. Recent research conducted with the sophisticated instruments of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, has suggested that the surface of Betelgeuse may be experiencing increased convective activity, which would result in material upwellings that are larger and more violent. It is possible that this would have resulted in the star experiencing a momentary increase in brightness due to the increased exposure of hot plasma at the surface. An additional potential factor that could be contributing to the sudden increase in brightness is the possibility of a large-scale mass ejection from the outer layers of Betelgeuse. Ejections of massive amounts of material are known to occur in red supergiants as they age. These ejections can result in the formation of large clouds of dust and gas that surround the star. When the surrounding environment is taken into consideration, such material has the potential to either obscure the light of the star or, in certain instances, reflect and amplify it. On the off chance that Betelgeuse has recently expelled a particularly dense shell of gas, it is possible that this material is interacting with the light coming from the star in a manner that causes the brightness of the star to be magnified when viewed from Earth. Events similar to Betelgeuse's brightness surge will probably happen more frequently as we continue to advance into the era of high-resolution space telescopes like the JWST, and our capacity to observe the universe increases. Through these telescopes, one can see how stars, galaxies, and the universe's larger structures are formed. The lessons learned from Betelgeuse's most recent episode are only the start of what may turn out to be a new chapter in our knowledge of galactic dynamics and stellar evolution. Betelgeuse's unexpected behavior serves as a reminder that there are still a lot of mysteries to be discovered, even as astronomers continue to add to their growing understanding of the workings of the universe with every new discovery. Betelgeuse's brightness surge also provides a case study on the unpredictability of the universe. Even though astronomy relies heavily on meticulous forecasting and long-term observation, many phenomena continue to defy explanation. The rise in luminosity of Betelgeuse serves as a reminder that even stars with extensive research histories can display behavior that defies accepted theories, which forces scientists to create new hypotheses and improve ones that already exist. This unpredictable nature is one of the things that draws so much interest in studying the universe. Every new observation has the power to change our understanding of the universe. If you like the video, please like it and subscribe to our channel. Also, please leave your comments below and tell us how you believe this will affect future space discoveries. We want to hear from you. Thank you for watching.